Hi, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to make a solar water heater with ABS pipe that you can hook up to a compressor so you can have nice water pressure and warm water at the same time. Um, you're going to want to get a 12 volt compressor to hook up to this thing. Alright, so for all of the parts I have ABS fittings. So here it is. To uh, start with, I have a 4 to 4 inch to 2 inch um, ABS T. I have a bulkhead. I have a screw top and a short piece of 2 inch ABS. These are pieces that I cut of 4 inch ABS pipe. I have my ABS glue and my spigot, my end cap. My other end cap that I already cut with the hole saw for my bulkhead to fit inside of. And here it is. Also a hacksaw. The size of the hole saw I used is 1 and 3 8 inch. Um, you're going to want to run the hole saw backwards when cutting, cutting in the ABS, but for, uh, it'll make for smoother edges. Yeah, you never want to forget your Teflon tape, but very useful for all your screw fittings. Don't forget to use sandpaper for the inner and outer edges of your pipe where the glue is going to be connecting them together. Nice rainy day out here, let's see if this glue can dry. Now that I have these three pieces glued together, all I have to do is prepare my end caps with my bulkhead, my spigot, and my valve stem. When you're putting on the bulkhead, make sure that you tighten it down nice and firm with a channel locks. Um, hand tightening just won't be tight enough, it'll probably leak. So this is the valve stem that I picked up from O'Reilly's. Um, I couldn't find this at any hardware stores. You have to go to automotive store, pick that up. And I drilled a 7 8 inch hole into my other end cap so I could fit it in. There it is. Uh, tighten it out, down nice and tight with an adjustable wrench, and it's ready to go. Here's a look at the end cap with the bulkhead and the attached spigot. Uh, everything's pretty much together. Um, all I have to do now is paint it, let it dry, and let it pressurize. I chose to go with a flat black paint. I wanted matte black, but this is all I had in the store. Um, flat black should work just fine to absorb enough light. All you want is it not to be shiny so it can heat up. So this is a $35 12 volt compressor for tires that I can hook up in my truck and this will pressurize the pipe right into the valve stem you see on the end there. So I have it all hooked up with the compressor running. Um, you can pre-pressure the pipe but you won't have pressure running the entire time if you do that. Um, you have better pressure if you keep the compressor running entire time but there it is looks like it works just fine great pressure and it was a success